Hey y'all, it's about three o'clock in the morning. Um, I gotta make a vlog. So I wanted to get this vlog started. Um, I'm gonna make a quick store run. So I'm gonna go to the store and get some more supplies, but we're doing a plate sale. Um, some people ordered some things last minute, so I gotta go and get some food, get some supplies before I get started cooking everything because, um, want to make sure we're prepared for later on because we don't want, we, we don't want to come up short. So let's get started, y'all. I'm... I'm a perk up, I promise. Y'all, it should be illegal to be getting up this early, but I gotta get some stuff um, because we always run a little bit late when we, well, when I do plates. So I got to get started. Um, Look, y'all see that? 627. I feel like I got a job, man. But um we we will converse when I get into the store. Hopefully by the time I get back home, I'll be feeling better. Because this is very early, you know, going to the store. And I hope them folks don't think I have a problem because I just left the store yesterday so these people are gonna be like what in the world did this boy want he couldn't get last night and he coming back here early in the morning but y'all just stay tuned because y'all will see can y'all see that el walamarta early this morning let's go in okay y'all my informant my informant was very wrong. They told me that Walmart opened at six o'clock in the morning, but I just went to the door, tried to go in. They said they don't open till seven. So now I got to kill 15 minutes in the car or doing something. So, uh, I don't know, y'all. 15 minutes ain't that long. It'll pass, bro. Yo, y'all see these people standing outside? They can let these folks in. And it's it's 6.59. Like, they can let these folks in. They just... This is this, this country all been the stuff. Because they can let these people in this door. Okay, y'all. I got in here. Um... <sighs> And I found everything I was looking for, so that's great. I had to get some french fries. To put ranch in for the plates. And some fried chicken, wow. We got, we doing uh, hot wings in the plates. So I had to make sure I get enough chicken. Because per usual, black people cannot do stuff cannot cooperate when you need them to so we had to make an emergency run to the store to make sure we got enough of everything okay y'all it is 7 13 i was in and out no time spent no time wasted um on lala gagging don't have time for that right now um it's still dark not fully awake so y'all i'm breathing hard it's seven o'clock in the morning. I shouldn't be breathing hard. Too fat. But I literally ran in and ran back out. But um, I'm gonna listen to some music, wake up a little bit more, and I'll see y'all when I get back to my residence. Hey there, gay people. Welcome back to my channel, y'all. Okay, I'm back at home. I've been home for a little minute. Um, It's like, maybe like nine o'clock, probably. I don't know. Um, but y'all see I'm better now. I'm more perkier. I done spruce myself up. Um, 
we're doing a plate sale, as I said before. Um, I ain't tell y'all what we have besides chicken wings, but we're doing um, baked chicken wings, fried chicken wings. Um, I make like a special sweet and spicy sauce. I'll show y'all that later. And um, for sides, we're doing pasta salad or fries. It's their choice. And um, I'm going to show y'all my pasta salad later. And um, I got a special order. Okay, y'all, I'm going to show y'all how to make some delicious busting pasta salad, some busting pasta salad. And y'all see that right there? Them some cucumbers I chopped up. Like, can Gordon Ramsay do that? No, I'm a professional. That's why they so chopped up. They look good. Them knife skills on point. And then you got some bell pepper cut up by Walmart, me. But, um, yeah, you get these I already mixed up. Um, together and you get a little ham this is how you go start your pasta salad this is what's gonna go in your pasta salad to make it look hard and meaty looking good okay y'all here go to seasoning because you got to season your food you nobody don't want no bland food so throw that ranch in there and then okay here we go some zesty zesty italian pour it in there glup, 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 glup. then we go get some on um, where that is oh some traditional ranch Pour it in there. Pour it in there. That ain't rich. That's Italian dressing, but put that in there. Okay, now you go get your bowl. You go get you some pasta. Oh, some Parmesan. Boom. Parmesan. Boom. Then you go get you some parsley. Why did? Boom. <laughs> then you go get you some garlic salt. Ain't no boom to this one, y'all. So, and then you, you go go from boiling noodles to looking like this. Look at this beautiful. Look at this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful pasta salad. And then they make that little noise like macaroni made. Like, <laughs> There it go, there it go right there, y'all. There it go, pasta salad made like a professional. You already know what we doing. A little more wet and creamy, but this is the finished product. To make sure your pasta is done, throw it. If it sticks, it's done. So that means it's done. Order for fried green tomatoes, and y'all, my knife skills are getting so much better because. I used to cut like chunky pieces, but now they like the perfect size. Fried green tomatoes, gonna be so good. Got some chicken thawing out now. Um, I done cleaned over 200 pieces of chicken, y'all. And what I mean by clean is roll the clip. Y'all see these feathers and hair. You, when you clean the chicken, this is what people mean by cleaning the chicken. You get the yellow stuff off of there. You cut some of that fat off. You get the feathers off. Cause who finna be eating some feathers in their chicken, man? That's disgusting. Y'all got to clean y'all chicken. Make sure it clean. Make sure it right. Cause don't nobody want no feathers. You can see them when you're frying. Nobody want no feathers. So long. Look at my finger. They are wilted. Yeah. They prony, man. This is what cleaning chicken do to you. Okay. Um, but I had to clean about over 200 pieces of chicken, and I still have chicken in the sink that I have to clean. Um, and I do everything pretty much because I'm like the I'm like the employee, and my grandma is just like the manager. But I do all the work. Like that's how they work in workplaces. I do mostly everything, and um. She just bossed me around pretty much. But yeah, y'all just stay tuned. Um everything looking good so far. Here go a little sneak peek of the chicken. Chicken looking good. Um yeah, and I get back with y'all. Oh, and I made some brownies to go in the place because <clears throat> I started off as just like a little treat just to give them. When I first did my plate sale, I just did, um, I just gave, I was just going to give them a brownie. And now people expect you to have brownies in the plate. But, um, yeah. So I'll get back with y'all. I'll show y'all my steps to make the pot salad. Um, and then I'm going to show y'all the final product of the pasta salad. And then I'm going to show y'all, like, how I get into making my sauce. And, um, 
food prep, um, plate fixing, all that good stuff. Y'all just stay tuned. All right, y'all, I done started on my special sauce that go on the wings. Let me show y'all. This is how it looks, you guys, before I put the um hot sauce in. And just go crazy with hot sauce, pretty much. Okay, y'all, here it go. It's bubbling. Um, It's going to simmer for a little while, and it's going to thicken up. I'm going to do a cooking tutorial on my wings and sauce because I know people be wondering how I be doing it. But I'm going to probably leave some stuff out because y'all don't need to know all my business because I have to hide some. Yeah. Y'all don't y'all don't need to know all of it because some stuff is classified information. So, but um, yeah, I got the sauce cooking. I'm doing a lot actually, um, because I got to make batter for my fried green tomatoes. I still have to um clean chicken wings, and I got a lot of stuff cooking at one time. Got stuff in the oven making brownies. Got a lot going on, so. I'm going to hit y'all back later. Okay. So, for those of you who know me personally, you know I just about could do above and beyond for anybody. So, a friend of mine wanted me to deliver her a plate. So, I was like, why not? Since I'm already going to Dawson, and, um, I got to draw some plates out to my mom. So, I might as well go and bring you your plate. So, tell me why I'm being a nice person trying to do stuff for people. It's a train holding up traffic, man. It's train. It's a train holding up all the traffic. Just my look. Car shaking, rattling, thinking it, it might just fall apart. I don't know. But we... I'm so frustrated, man. Cause this is not what I wanted to be doing. I done been I done been sitting here for about a good four to five minutes. But I'm I'm just I'm running out of gas. Giving out of gas. My car shaking. It's hot. I don't know. I don't know what to do. And y'all okay, I want y'all to see this. I want y'all to see. Don't look like that many cars in front of me, right? Well, Y'all see my rear view mirror? Do y'all see all them cars behind me? Do y'all see him? Y'all see all them cars behind me? This is very upsetting, man. And nothing's happening, nothing's moving. All right, y'all. Um, I didn't finish the video. I didn't close the vlog last time. So... What I'm going to do is just give y'all like an overview of everything. Um, the sale went good. I did great. Um, a lot of satisfied customers. I'm going to put some pictures up here of what the plates kind of look like. Everything looks good. Everything went good. Um, y'all, make sure y'all subscribe. Y'all like and y'all comment. Um, it was fun filming what I do like during on the weekends or whatever. And um, y'all just stay tuned. More videos coming. Y'all stay tuned. All right, y'all. I'm out.